Okay, so a lot of you guys have been asking me, how do I set up my PC controls for T3 Arena? And that's exactly what we're gonna be covering for today's video. So the first thing that I need for you guys to do is to actually load up T3 Arena because, well, duh, like we're trying to load up our configuration. So now let's actually head over to the options tab, right? And let's go to the layout tab. Now you guys can choose the casual layout, two finger, three, whatever works best for you. But let me just tell you, the reason why I went with the custom layout was because of this lovely uh, screen here. So in order to move the buttons for you, you guys right all you gotta do is click on it and make sure you like you know just to size it up like however big you want it but i just recommend putting it the smallest as possible and then just dragging it to a location that you know you see fit so you're gonna rinse and repeat this process to get a screen like this that just looks phenomenal and now this next step is gonna look like a shameless plug but i promise you <laughs> it is a shameless plug if you use discord right make sure to join my discord inside of the description below there's a reason i promise you when you join my discord you have all of these rules right all you got to do is press this lovely little green check button and then all the channels is going to show up all right then you're going to head over to the configs channel and there is my lovely t3 arena config you're just going to hit on that and, it, and like it'll download for you on your pc i promise it's no hacks i have have no type of time for that okay and then just like that we're back on t3 arena now in order to import these configs right what you're going to need to do is that you're going to hit on these lovely game controls and then you're going to hit on open advanced editor now my config is obviously already here because it's my config but uh what you guys are going to do is that you guys are going to hit this import button which is this button right here and then wherever you stored the configuration here chat or the guys right uh you're gonna type in the file name tap on it and press import okay so once when you have imported the configuration you're gonna see loads of white buttons just like this wasd everyone knows is just to move around this left trigger button right here is to actually for you to shoot and i'll explain to you how that actually works a little bit later the c button is my reload button trust me i know you can easily swap this to r if you usually use this on any type of uh, shooter game okay the minus button is actually my mouse button up it's the first mouse button on my mouse button and likewise for the equal button is my mouse button down the reason why that i have minus and equals is because i edit on premiere pro so i just bounded those keys to my mouse lastly the space bar uh is now my jump button so all you would have to do is once when you uh see all of these uh lovely little buttons you just click click and hold and then drag it right on top of the respective things that you want it to work now let's say if you don't want c to be a reload button okay all you have to do is click it once and then hit the key that you want I just swapped it to R and now it's R. But since I'm, you know, my config, I'm gonna put it back to C. So now you guys might be asking, what exactly is this right click and what exactly is this left trigger? Please do not delete either of the two, all right? Because without the right click, it, it, you, you, your aiming is not going to work. <laughs> so if you guys ever want to be able to play a game of T3 Arena, okay? You're always going to need to hit the right click button. <laughs> What's gonna happen is that your mouse is going to disappear. And once when your mouse disappears, now you can be able to move left to right as you guys see in the gameplay to the right or to the left. Okay. <laughs> and once when you have right clicked and you're able to now look up, down, left, or right, whenever you left click, uh, your gun is going to be able to shoot for you. So now I'm going to cover a little bit of things that makes things a little bit easier for my controls on T3 Arena or, you know, just any uh, like mobile game in general. So one thing is that, guys, when you load this up, it's going to be 0 0.32, 0 0.32. This is your sensitivity. Adjust accordingly, okay? <laughs> and if you love yourself in this world, okay, just head over the game controls. You see this open capacity thing right because uh, it should be at 100 percent. do me a favor and drag that all the way to zero once when you get used to your configurations all right and last but not least uh these are actually my sensitivity controls or just like my controls in general if you guys would like to copy it wait hold on let me actually swap that off but if you guys would like to copy it you guys most definitely most definitely can go right ahead but i hope that this answers one of the most commonly asked questions that i get and i hope that you guys enjoy the video drop a subscribe peace